What is good? What is poppin'? It's your boy Mulani K. I mean what I say and tell me who's taking me cause I'm here to stay. Well, messy Period. assholes don't speak on me. Keep my name out your mouth cause I don't beat for free. <laughs> So I want to get to the lighting. So if you see that the lighting is changed for the people that's back on my channel, it's because I have my gold ring light on and not my white ring light on. So it's just, just a little color change. But if you like it, comment down below. Okay, so as you can see by the title and the thumbnail, we're going to be talking a little about this time. We're going to talk about this time when a boy felt bold enough to spit on me like ill disgusting it sounds just like how it's coming out like spit like ill like who could just sit there and spit on somebody but i guess this person felt bold enough to spit on me but yeah like i said we're gonna get into that make sure you like comment share and subscribe if you're not subscribed baby what are you doing subscribe join k mafia thank you for all the people that have been subscribing and have been reposting to me on their instagram i've been seeing you Period. On the road to 2K on my Instagram. On the road to 200 subs on my YouTube. Period. Without further ado, let's get into this video. So, we're going to start from the beginning, the beginning, but the beginning. So, there was this boy named Elliot. Elliot always had, like, this problem with me. Like, always just had, like, a problem with me because I did music. He did music. It, just a lot. It just was a lot, bro. He just had a big problem with me. And it was just like, what you have a problem with me? Like, I never did nothing to this boy. Never bothered this boy. Never even sat at the same table with this boy because I just wanted to get out his face. Very bipolar. Very one minute want to be my friend. One minute, not my friend, but want to be cool with me. The next minute want to talk behind my back. It was like, didn't know what he wanted to do. So one day I come outside after school it was like two months left two months left into school and all of that so like i'm ready to just graduate or get up out that school or just move on like that's all i was trying to do but it's like somebody always want to come in my way when i'm about to like just move on but it was this boy named elliot i went outside after school or whatever and the park is like a big park so like a lot of people go there that park is popping or whatever the hood you know the hood neighborhood park neighborhood park so this boy elliot felt it was cute to come to the park and start picking at me and my best friend but it wasn't only me and my best friend he only came at the table because he was dating some girl and the girl was sitting at the table with me and my best friend. And then some boy that I like was sitting at the table, you know, with us too. So we was all just talking. And he came over there to, you know, talk to his girlfriend or whatever. But, you know, people that just do a lot and want to do too much because they see their little girlfriend like, girl. Like, you could have took your girlfriend and go over there. But, you know, he wanted to act tough in front of her and show him, show her that he's you know big bad wolf so he end up so he end up coming talking about me and my best friend talk about oh how we look like this and how i'm gay and how i'm such a faggot okay let me be a faggot by myself the hell i'm not bothering you like let me be a faggot by myself let, let me be you know i'm not bothering you at all so elliot just kept on picking at me and my best friend. My best friend wasn't having it. So my best friend was like, yo, Elliot, you doing a little too much. You need to go somewhere. And I'm just staying quiet because I'm not going to act like I wasn't, you know, ever scared in my life. Like, of course, I was scared once upon a time in my life, but not now. But back then, I was just scared and he was trying me. But I was just like, let me just be quiet. Let me just stay quiet. He ain't, you know, on nothing. He ain't trying to put his hands on me, so let me be quiet. But he just continued to carry on, even if I was quiet or not. So, like, I can't win or lose. He just keep on talking about me. Keep on talking about me. You gay. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. I'm just like, what you want me to fight you for? Like, I didn't say nothing to you. That's what I'm saying in my head. I'm just like, keep on ignoring him. So, I got my scary ass up and I moved over and I went to the table. 
where all the seats and the table is connected. So I'm like, okay, I move. And this boy, you know, is still antagonizing me. Oh, you're gay this and you're gay that. Then he had to sit there and post a video. He posted a video on Snapchat. I don't have the video, but he posted a video on Snapchat and he was just talking and talking and talking and talking on Snapchat, posting me and my best friend. Oh, your best friend is a bum. And then talk about how I'm a faggot and I'm gay. And then all of a sudden, like 10 minutes later of him just trying to act all hard, he gets like in front of me where I'm sitting on the table. He's in front of me and I'm just like, Elliot, like you don't want no smoke. Like leave me alone. Like just leave me alone. And he just like, keep on and keep on and keep on. So then he's going to wait till I turn my head. I go like that to turn my head. And this boy sits there and threw a sprinkler spray. He didn't do a hog spit, but he threw a sprinkler spray too. Like, girl, it's like you wanted to throw a spit, but you knew better. So you just do that too. Like, girl. Like, girl. He spits on me. So I'm just like, I just feel like all this, like, it's like, you know how you spray perfume and you just feel like, or you spray it in the air and it comes down, girl. It was like one of those. So I was just like, I know you did not just spit on me. I know the hell you did not just spit on me or whatever. So I turned back around. As soon as he spit on me, he hurried up and walked across the room and grabbed his book bag. So his girlfriend or his ex-girlfriend, whatever he was, she was to him, he was just, you know, trying to hurry up and leave or whatever. And he was like, it was like he was trying to call somebody because I was getting hyper. And I was like, let me go. Let me go. My best friend had me. I'm like, let me go. Like, he don't want my best friend. Like, he's not worth it. He's not worth it. Like, I'm like, no, but I guess people didn't see that he just spit on me. I'm like, no, he just spit on me. He need to get laid out. Like, my mom told me to lay his, you know, lay anybody out. They put their hands on you or disrespect you and that type. Like, he didn't put his hands on me, but he tried to do that little spit on me. So, he spit on me, and I was like, okay, cool. But he's also known for jumping. So, I said, let me go to my house and go get my mom's. So, I go to my house, and my mom is gone. I call my mom like, mama. This boy, Elliot, just spit on me. My mom's like, he just spit on you. What did you do or whatever? Like, did you lay him out? Well, mama, no. My be best friend was holding me back. And not only that, you know, he's known for jumping or whatever. And who's finna get jumped? Not me. So, I got no time for that. So, I'm like... She's like, okay, just wait till I get home. I handle the situation. I'm like, okay, bet. So I go back outside. My best friend is like, okay, I'm going to just go home or whatever. I'm like, okay, I'm going to just handle it myself. So he started going around with rumors talking about I didn't pop off. I didn't do this, baby. You was ready to be scared and walking off. So then we got to school, like, the weekend. So, like, I had to wait, like, the whole entire wait, like, till school starts back up. So I'm like, when school starts back up, when I see him, it's on site. It's a problem. So... My mom goes up to the school when school opens back up, talk to them about the problem. They really can't do much because it was off school grounds or whatever, which I was happy that they said that because now it was like, now when I lay him out, don't say nothing like, oh, it's off school grounds too. Like, don't just don't say nothing. I'm going to lay him out. And that's just going to be that. So I see him in school. I'm just like, okay, since you was big and bad, like, what's up? Whatever. So I'm walking past the bathroom. Baby boy say something under his breath. Baby. What you saying something under your breath for? Like, baby, pop off now. Just pop off now. You had all that mouth. You was, pop pop off now. Talk about, oh, little boy. He's like, oh, little boy, you can move or move, little boy. And I was like, baby, you're a little boy. Like, who just spit? If I'm going to spit on somebody, I'm going to make sure I gather my spit and spit on you, baby. You did a little too. Sprinkler spray, baby. My, my, like, come on, baby. There's people, there's four-year-olds that could do better than that. Like, you're a little boy who spits, baby. You could have just threw a punch. And that would have just been the end of that. So, I was like, you know, like, I clapped back at him. Like, baby, you don't want no smoke. And then that was the end of it. He wanted to go to the bathroom. I had to go to the bathroom. But instead of him going to the bathroom, he waits till I leave her out the bathroom. Then he goes in the bathroom. It was like some scary stuff. I'm not sure. We don't have beef now um, because that happened, like, I could say, like, a year and a half ago or two years ago. But he don't want to smoke, and that's just that. That's the end of my story time of me getting spit on. If if you think that you could spit on me now, baby, it's 2020, babies. I look so good. 
But like I said, that's it for the video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. That was a short, cute story time. If you want more story times, baby, comment down below. I have some juicy story times, freaky story times, nasty story times, just story times that I can keep on telling. If you like me and you want to watch more of me, then what are you doing? Click the subscribe button. And that's just that, okay? Okay, say it with me. Okay, period. Peace. Classic, bougie, classic, bougie, classic, bougie, classic, bougie, classic, bougie.